Hello and welcome to Robidon's Fallout 4 Let's Play. You voted for my character and you, what did you choose? You chose my character to be an arsehole, so that's what this playthrough is going to be. I'm not quite sure whether to go for Rick the Dick or Rob the Knob, but we shall see. That is going to be my character's name and that is going to be my character's attitude. Let's see what Fallout 4 has to offer us. What are the settings? What are the gameplay? Difficulty. Hard. But why? No, I don't need to do that because I'm not one of those generations of people who uh, played a lot of, uh, what's the word, flight games or anything like that. Save it if I turn it in, if I have it enabled. Got that off for now. I will be using it. Is that it? Control. Accident. Ah, uh, the game will teach me that. Right. Display. Uh, general subtitles on. You need to be able to see them. And on, because you're watching. You will be watching me, he says optimistically. Ah, ha, ha. Yes. So. New game. What are we going to get? Start a new game, enter, well of course that's what we're going to do, that's what we're here for. Let's be quiet. And see what we get. My great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. Interesting. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. Really? We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing. It's that war. War never changes. <laughs> 